On November 9, 1874, a group of civic-minded people met at the newly constructed town hall to form the Elmer Mechanics Institute and Library Association. By 1878, the Institute had a collection of 793 books. This was the first institution in Elmer where you could borrow a book, but it was only available to men, and only if you were over 16. The Institute held lectures, evening classes, and operated a billiards room. The reading room was open on Wednesday and Friday evenings, as well as one hour on Saturday afternoon. Many of the books were scientific. The railway had recently arrived in Elmer, and the people had to learn how to fix and operate the new machines. By the beginning of the 20th century, Elmer was a small but prosperous village. The Elmer Reading Room was then operating out of the second story of 29 Talbot Street East, in the rooms above what is now Durkee's Clothing Store. In 1911, some people thought the reading room was too small, and they started a petition for a bigger, better library that everyone could use. The village council agreed, but they didn't have enough money to build a nice new library. At the same time, one of the richest men in the world, Andrew Carnegie, was giving money to cities and towns around the world to help them build libraries. Elmer had asked Mr. Carnegie for money before, and he said no. But Elmer filled out some more forms and sent them away. And this time the answer was yes. And he sent $8,000. Mr. Nairn from the cannery donated some land at the corner of Center and Sydenham Streets, which is just over there, and the Carnegie Library was built. Imagine $8,000 to build a building. The red brick building opened the spring of 1913, 100 years ago. It has 7,000 books, enough for everyone in Elmer to check out three books each. Free to use, open six days a week, with a growing catalog of books, and even women and children could borrow books. This was Elmer's first real library, a library for everyone. Generations of Elmerites learned to read, worked towards their dreams, and explored the world through the books at Carnegie Library. In 1940, the Elmer Library became part of the Elgin County Library System. Elmer readers now had access to many more books, and in cooperation with the town of Elmer, the library continued to flourish. By the 1970s, the library had become so popular and had collected so many books, it was becoming cramped in the Carnegie Building. The town council began looking for a new place to put the library. The old town hall, built in 1872, was sitting empty on John Street. It was a beautiful building near the center of town, but it needed a lot of work to transform this old administrative building into a library. Not everyone in Elmer agreed a new library was needed or that the money should be spent. After a lengthy court battle, the council decided to go ahead with renovating the old town hall and on June 18, 1982, it opened as the new Elmer Library. The old town hall was transformed into a beautiful library at the heart of Elmer. The new library built on the strength of the Carnegie. Today, it is the most active branch in the Elgin County system serving a diverse rural community. In the years since its opening, the library has become an important public space in Elmer's vibrant downtown. Once again, the library finds itself outgrowing its home, and once again, the town faces the agonizing decision to leave a building that has become a dear friend. Plans for a new, modern library are underway, a place for new generations of Elmerites to fill with their memories. Just like the past, the future holds changes. The library will be there to assist in dealing with, benefiting from, and creating that change. There are now nearly a quarter million items available through the Elgin Library System, and millions more available through interlibrary loans and e-books. With the gift of education and the power of knowledge, Elmer will continue to forge its own destiny. Mindful of the past, with our eyes on the future, the Elmer Library. 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 The Elmer Bibliotheque. The Elmer Library. The Elmer Library. The Elmer Library.